Okay. Hentaro Nagaoka was a Japanese scientist. Okay. He was a Japanese scientist and he thought about the evidence for Thomson model. The Thomson plum pudding model, he thought the evidence for that. He read about the evidence also collected by other scientists as well. And then he said that Thomson model could not be correct. According to him, according to Nagaoka, he said that Thomson model cannot be correct. Why is not it is not correct? He said that it is not possible for negative charges to be spread out in a positively charged pair. Flum pudding model tells us that the negative particle, the ne electrons are basically spread out in the positively charged sphere. So they, that model says that the atom is basically a positive sphere and the negative charged particles are basically revolving in them like a plum in pudding. So Nagaoka said that it is not possible for negative charges to be spread out in the positively charged sphere because when they are spread together, they can attract one another. So that's why he thought that it is not possible. But in 1904, Nagaoka suggested a new model for the atom. Now we are going to see what that model was. That model was called Nagaoka's Saturn model. And Saturn, you know, it is a planet, okay? So he basically compared the atom to a solar system. He compared the atom to a Saturn, planet Saturn. So that is the model we are going to study right now that is known as Nagaoka's Saturn model. Let's see what Nagaoka's Saturn model says. According to this model, an atom consists of a positively charged center. Okay. He said that an atom consists of a positively charged center and the electron orbits around the center in rings. Okay. Just like a solar system, like that of the planet Saturn. So you have seen the planet Saturn and that a big, a big ball is present in the center and there is an orbit around that. So Nagaoka said that the nucleus is basically a positive charged particle present in the center and around the nucleus there are orbits present and the electrons are basically revolving around that center in a ring that is like a planet Saturn. So he used his model to predict that an atom has a nucleus with a large mass. He called, he said that atom has a nucleus who has a bigger mass and the electron revolves around that nucleus. Let's see what Nagaoka model look like. This is about the Nagaoka's model. He said that, what he said, a cent at the center, there is a large positive charge. So you can see that there is a large ball present in the center, it is positive. And there is a, a ring present around that center. In that ring, there are electrons present, the negative charge particles are present. So according to Nagaoka, he said again that at the center, a large particles, a positive particle will be present and a negatively charged electron will be orbit around this charge. This is called Nagaoka's atomic model or Saturn, Nagaoka's Saturn atomic model. So you can see that it's just like the, the planet Saturn. In the center, there is a big ball. There is a circle around, and that circle, the electron revolves. So this is the system, This is the model which was presented by Nagaoka. He is again a Japanese physicist. Okay. So let's uh, come to the screen. If you have any question regarding Nagaoka's model, you can ask the. Sir? 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 Like, Sir. 
Sir. Sir, are you there? Sir has left the meeting. Right. Uh, sorry for the interruption. I think there was some problem in the internet. Internet. So again, any question? Sir, I'm having a question. Yes, ask now. Sir, Th uh, Thompson also said that uh, the electrons are negatively charged and they move in a and they move in a ring uh, around the nucleus and sir he did not say that it remove it. he did not say that they uh, they revolve around in a ring he said that they were the, the negative charged particles are scattered spread in the positively charged electrons or uh, protons sorry okay sir so there's a problem there's a little bit confusion in the uh, plum pudding model plum pudding model say that the electrons are spread in the positively charged sphere. And Nagaoka model says that there is a central positive particle present, which is the bigger particle, and the electron revolves around that positive particles in a ring. There is there is a little bit uh, difference between the, them. And sir, plum, uh, plum pudding model is a bit confusing. Yeah, that it is a it is a bit confusing because that was not a clear model. Sir, Nagaka didn't know about the nucleus. Nay, no, nobody knew about the nucleus until now. Definitely, the nucleus is not discovered until now. Sir, okay, sir. When we will discuss about the nucleus in the next topic. Don't worry. They were just they did it. They just knew about electrons. Okay, they knew about electrons because electrons were discovered. Electrons were sir, discovered by J J Thomson and others. बेटा आवाज आपकी बहुत कट गई दोबारा से क्वेश्चन करें सर सर नगा ने जो मॉडल बनाया था वो सेटन का जैसा था लेकिन सेटन के बीच में एक बीच में एक एक वो होता है एक बॉल टाइप होता है और बाकी उसके आसपास रिंग होते हैं तो वो जो बीच में था वो उसने न्यूक्लियस नहीं था he didn't say that it is the nucleus he said that is a positive charged particle okay no but nobody knew about proton now i'm telling you they just knew about electron they just knew about electrons so they assume that when negative charged particle are present there should be positive particles as well सर अभी तक क्या नाम है न्यूक्लियस डिस्कवर नहीं हुआ तो उसके बारे में बिगिनिंग we studied about the atomic atomic model the modern atomic model was a new model and that new model uh, the electron sub particle were discovered okay but later on uh, we discovered that what the, the particle basically was discovered by jj thomson uh, golden stein and cham chadwick they are the three scientists who discovered the three particles of the atom so until now we have discussed the one we have discussed the electrons and all the models we are presenting now are based on electrons is it clear sir so electrons yes. are originally discovered by jj thompson
Yes, J.J. Thompson and his other scientists as well. And we discussed about the other one as well, na? So, but the lead work was of J.J. Thompson. Sir, okay. why Nagoka said that his creations are not, model is not because if you imagine, if you imagine positive and negative particles and positive and negative charges are present with one another at the same place, what will happen? They will attract one another. If the positive and negative charge particle attract one another, the atom can be destroyed. But the atoms cannot be destroyed. Actually, the atom is not going to be destroyed. So there was some problem in the plum pudding model. So that's why Nagaoka came with another model and he gave his explanations. Okay? No, Nagaoka model is correct or not correct. Sorry? Only electrons are discovered. Yes, until now we are just discussing electrons. Sir, may I ask a question from yesterday, uh, from yesterday lecture? Yes, if it is related, definitely ask. Yes, sir, please explain the fluorescent versus. Sir, fluorescent screen. Sorry? Sir, explain for fluorescent screen, please. Fluorescent screen is basically a detective screen. So when the rays strike on their screen, it forms a kind of glow and spots on their screen. To detect something, nah? like for example, we want to detect, we want to detect the rays. So we cannot see the rays. We have to detect on a certain kind of screen. So the fluorescent screen is a kind of screen that can produce glow. Like, for example, the fluorescent screen is a kind of screen like the TV screen. You can see the images and pictures on that. So as basically, uh, you can see the images. You can see uh, the striking of the rays. Otherwise, you would not be able to see the rays. Sir, fluorescent screen is never an IT. Fluorescent screen is never an IT. Hello. Yes, sir. Fluorescent screen kisne banayati? Definitely, it's not going to be made from a from by one scientist. It is a uh, collective work of many. We'll okay, discuss sir, that, inshallah. Don't worry about that. If you have any kind of such questions, you can ask them later as well. Okay. But now, if you have any question in Nagaoka's model, you can ask it here right now. Is there any question regarding Nagaoka's model? Okay, so we have to move to the next now, okay? So that we can move on to the next and we can understand that what now next happening in the cell. Let's see in the next now. Okay. So this was the uh, Nagaoka's Saturn model. Let's see the next. Now this is very much important, discovering the nucleus. Before this, we did not discuss about the nucleus. We discussed about positive particles. And all the models, the plum pudding model, the Nagaoka's model, they were saying positive particles, okay? A positive sphere, a positive mass, just nucleus because the nucleus was not discovered then so that's why they did not discuss anything about the nucleus let's see how the nucleus discussed discovered so discovering the nucleus uh to this there was his name was rutherford so rutherford did what he tested the flum pudding model okay and there were many scientists with him uh, other scientists with him as well, but the pioneer scientist was rutherford so scientists Thought about the Thomson plum pudding model and was explaining electrons. We knew that there is a lot of evidence present uh, for the electrons in that model, but there was no evidence present on the positive. We know that how this positive charge is definitely. Sir, I was not cut, 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 cut,